How do you build a momentum? Well, your next day starter is the way you build on it or the way you lose it. And they're going to need a better out output out of Framber Valdez, and his sinker is going to be the key. If he can throw strikes with his sinker, whoo he's got a lot of weapons to quiet this offense. But if he doesn't, the offense will win out. Inside corner struck him out. Borderline pitch, and Valdez gets the call. One away. See, he has so much movement, Joe, that he sometimes right, tries to be too perfect, I think. And that's easier said than done when you just say, start it down the middle and let it move. He pulled that sinker, got away with it, and it hit the inside part of the plate. Instead, he strikes out. Strikeout number two for Fromber. Renfro. Three. Take strike three. And already three strikeouts for Valdez. Here's a one two Vasquez strikes out and Fromber Valdez in total control so far. Might be two Correa flips out over to first got them both. And that is what Valdez gets ground balls and he turns this one into a twin killing two out and a 2 0 -oh pitch with first and second nobody out. That just shows you the quality of his late breaking sinker. Now the Red Sox are going to have to rely on a two out run that the Astros have feasted on in the postseason. One and two the count the next swing and a miss struck him out strikeout number five for Valdez. I see again what I love about this start for Valdez is he did not show his curveball early at all. It was sinkers and getting a lot of ground ball outs. One two. Might be two. Altuve. Correa. Double play. Second turn tonight. Second one hit into by Hunter Renfro. But it's all Fromber so far. He's been completely controlled. Like no big thing. High fly ball into left. Back near the wall. It's caught by Brantley. Another one, two, three inning for Valdez, who is through eight. In control, having fun, rolling in game five.